dive into it. <laughs> we were, we we're fucking looking at Kakariko Village. I love that. Oh yeah, there's Kakariko. In a minute. Let me see if Joshua has anything else for us. Do you have any more side quests for me? So remember that fragment I had? The one that showed a single mysterious figure? I found more fragments among the, the things our survey team brought back from the depths. And guess what? They fit together like puzzle pieces. Okay. Ta da! Just look. Oh, that is. Oh. Interesting. That is interesting. Okay. Feast your eyes upon this amazing mural. This scene shows that there's a whole series of statues down there, like the one you found for me last time. But what really caught my attention is the way they're oriented. Each figure is pointed towards the next one in the series until it ends with the last statue facing the final destination, a building that looks like a temple. Hmm. Also, see those large ears on the figure in the front of the building? That's gotta be one of the Zonai. <laughs> then there's that strange hand symbol that seems to be responding to whatever the Zonai is doing. It's the ultra hand. It's me. <laughs> well, it's my arm. So to collect my thoughts on all of this, I'm pretty sure if you follow the gaze of each of those statues down there, you'll reach that structure. I'm also betting that the temple-like building holds something of Zonai origin. I've heard that the Zonai wielded mysterious powers. I wonder if this correlates to those powers. Of course, all this is just speculation on my part. So, <laughs> that's where you come in, swordsman. I want you to find the temple structure depicted in the mural. Initially, I figured I could just go myself, so I gathered a bunch of bright blooms and supplies. Aww. But they pulled the kid card on me and said I couldn't go into the depths. So, here. Fantastic. Love bright boom seeds. You can have these too. Arrows. She knows the way to my heart, man. Yeah. <laughs> bright blooms and arrows are perfect for exploring the depths. There's the added bonus that checking out the depths might provide us with clues to help find Princess Zelda. So if it all works out, maybe you'll snag some mysterious power for yourself and gain clues about Princess Zelda. Nothing but good things, right? Thanks for your help with the swordsman. Hey! <laughs> We go, we going back in. All right, so we're going back into the chasm. I still need more stamina. So, do you like just follow me? All right, we meet back here. Fucking go. God, this shit looks so fucking gross. Cool. So I went that way. To find the statue. So I guess we're just gonna go back over there. And hopefully I don't fight any of the fucking glue monsters, because that'd be that'd be very unfortunate. I do like it down here though, with the uh the light roots, you know, glowing so it's not like dark. That's nice. <laughs> oh, what are you? Oh, they fight me. Okay, um, I didn't want to fight you. You're cute. No. They're cute. Wait, I feel bad. No, oh, my god. Really, you guys have to make me go close to them. At least they're like easy and they're not buffed out. What? Oh god. Okay, this is already going downhill. This is already going downhill. Hey, well, I guess I could zone I know. So this light route, there's the statues. So if I go this way. Of course, it's gonna be like a lot of camps on the way, right? What are you? Oh. Like, like, Pose? Like, the, the statue by Jasha says Pose? I'm very scared. I do not like this at all. I'm just gonna mind my business. Go, my fucking god, and go over to the light route. Oh, big area. Damn, it opens up so much. Oh, that's right. I had to get above ground for it to recover that. I forgot about that. That's a whole ass camp. Damn. All right, good to know. I will be staying away from that. That's terrifying. I don't want to deal with that because fighting things are scary. Not what I wanted. <laughs> um, 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 why are you so big, sir? Please. No, please. Ah. <laughs> oh God. No, 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 no. Wait, wait. Ah, uh, no. Let me out. 
Don't kill me. Please. Oh, for the love of God. <laughs> Thank God. Alright, now that I know what I'm doing, this is a lot easier. Oh, no. I did not have a bashy thing. Oh, no, there's my bashy thing. Yeah. God damn it. I think, I think I'm doing okay. I think this thing is fucking huge and has a lot of health though. Oh please, just murder it. No? God damn it. All right, doing good. I got the strat down, I got the strat down. He dead. <sighs> uh, did not like, did not like. And then you're facing the okay, cool. Cool. Still in the That's not cool though. I love just exploring the depths. Not knowing what the fuck I'm gonna find. Perfect. What is this? Oh what? Impa? Yo, according to Ko, this location will be destroyed. Glory O Master Ko Ga Master Koga? Ao Master Koga, my guy? We gonna have to play Master Koga again? So, where were you pointed? Of course, right by... Oh my god! Let's <laughs> get mm -hmm. the shit out of me. Yeah, it's all night. Fuck. Fuck. Not what I wanted, not what I wanted, not what I wanted. I'm just chomping through my weapons. God damn. I hate that they saw me now. <laughs> oh, that throws fire. Cool. Nice to know. I guess we're taking over the camp. <laughs> it's not what I intended to do, but they left me no choice. Okay, so you guys point that way? All right, cool. So we're going this way. I think that's the temple, guys. I think that's the temple. I can also bash them. So I learned I learned a thing, right? Come here. Come here, little guy. I've learned a thing that I can just... <laughs> and he did. <laughs> <laughs> All I had to do was just pick them up. I used to be so scared of them, but like now they're fucking nothing. There you go. He faces this way. Towards the temple. See, what the fuck is that? Shoots butt? I don't know if I want to shoot it. I don't know if I even want to anger that shit. What is it? Oh wait, can I even reach him? Nothing happened. I'm gonna save. And then I'll go down. Cause like, why not? You just... You just giving it to me? Hold on. I'll drop something if you're just giving it to me. Actually, no. I'll drop this since it's almost dead. He cute. He gave me a little thing. That's adorable. Great abandoned central mine. Am I going to fight something? Okay. A hand thing. Zonai thing. Cool. With the wheels. Please don't tell me how to... There's guys here. Do I have to fix this? Are they gonna yell at me? Oh. Hold on. What are you guys gonna say? I didn't think we'd see anybody else down here. Though, I imagine you could say the same to us, huh? Oh. We're here to investigate too, right? You know, since we took the, uh, er, I mean, <laughs> since you took the, er, I mean, the survey team interview. Yeah. Because we definitely took that interview too, and that's why we're here yet. Yeah. Take a look at this. Our latest discovery it nearly knocking us off our feet. We found this weird device with all the wavering green letters on it. And this is strange statue. We think it's one of those living stone constructs. Pretty sure it's supposed to move. Uh, well, I said that's, but it's just all conjecture on my part. Truth is, we're in a bit of a panic here. If we don't figure out how this thing works soon, we're gonna be in big trouble. All right, what do you guys say? Oh, did you pass the interview too? He obviously did. Why else <laughs> would he come strolling into a place like this? Ugh, why do I even bring it up? Oh. Uh, just forget it. It's not important. What is important is the text we're investigating is fascinating. It claims that the stone statue should be able to grant us an ancient power. Ancient power? That's right. The peculiar stone statue is nothing less than one of the fabled constructs. 
In fact, I have some writing here that explains the so-called ancient power in detail. The resistibility will allow you to commit any structure you create to memory. The auto build! Any fucking object committed to memory can be instantly reproduced to recreate anything we made. Survey team's uh, investigation of this land would be swift and unstoppable. The text further claims that this construct should be able to grant us the power, or we just need to wake it up. I bet. But... Let's fucking go. Auto build life. Authorizer verified. Oh, it's moving. Hello. God, I love these things. They're so cute. Conferring auto build to authorizer now. Please utilize it as you explore and excavate the depths for Zonite. Here you go. Take my hand. Fuck yeah. Auto build. Finally, my last <laughs> utility. Instantly recreate your ultra hand projects using nearby items in Zonite. Auto build records your previous records your previous creations. Did I see what I thought I saw? Did that thing just give you the power to have been researching? That's incredible. C could you give us a demonstration? Let me see what the text has to say. This ability will allow you to commit any structure you can create to memory. Any object you commit to memory can be instantly reproduced. You know just what I use it on? As luck would have it, both our vehicles just broke, and we've been struggling to put them back together again. The one on the round pedestal lost a wheel, and that one completely fell apart. Cool. <laughs> Take the wheel back on the first one. You should be able to use your power to repair the second one in no time. <laughs> Let's repair it. And, uh, there. It's a little weird, <laughs> but it's fine. It's snug as a bug. Now time for main event. Five years fix up a lickety split. Well, let me do my job now. Let me fix this fucking wheel because it's kind of. It's throwing me for a loop. And I want to fix it. Uh, no? Let me fix uh, it. It's not It's not the same as the others. It's fucking. Ah, fine. That one. Here you go. Alright. Whoa, it's like I'm seeing double. Build less than no time flat. This is exactly what I was hoping for. Thank you, ancient power. The texts are right after all. I said that power is incredible. Oh, master! <laughs> master Koga. Oh, look at that. The legends were true. I fucking knew it. I knew there was going to be a reason why I had me read something about Master Koga. I'm not prepared for this fight. <laughs> <laughs> Great work, both of you. You too, stranger. Credit where credit is due. Yes, credit where credit is... <laughs> if there's one foe I'll never forget, it's the man who cast me from my Gerudo Desert hideout into these very depths. It was you! Now I live for vengeance, both upon that no-good Zelda and upon my sworn enemy. That means you, Link. We meet again at last. And don't try to tell me you've forgotten me. We are bound by fate, you and I. Hear my name and tremble in fear. I am the leader of the Giga Clan, the strong, the depths defying, from the ashes rising. <laughs> Master Koga. Oh my god, okay. I saw it all. I saw the moment you obtained the ancient power we've sought for so long. The highlight of all the musty old texts we found in this land. It remembers objects you've assembled and can instantly reproduce them. The long lost ability from the distant past. You, you, you're cheating. <laughs> I'm not cheating, I'm just better. <laughs> Here we are, working ourselves to the bone to build things by hand. And you can just whip them up in an instant, it's not fair. <laughs> you know, who could have used that power? The one we worship and revere, the magnificent one. If we offered it to him, he would have been, he would have crushed you and Zelda both. But you just walked right up and snatched it away. Now I'm going to snatch it back. Oh god. I thought this was gonna be a fight. Hear yourself. Um. Okay. If I just. Can I, can I just run on? I don't think so. Fuck you. Well, I hit him. Oh my god. I just keep doing this. I know. Ah, oh, goddammit. I'm here. 
Let me get on your little drive. Boy. Can't, him going in circles sucks ass. He's adding stuff as we're going. What a cheat. Oh, not what I meant to do. Not what I meant to do. Okay, well, I'm doing I'm doing good damage to him. I think I think it's gonna be Oh my god. Oh my god. Holy shit. That was not nice. Fucking bitch. Grr, you pest you pesky little pest. Why won't you stand still and let me squish you? Cause you dumb. Oh fine. I suppose I can let you off easy for today. You think you're so smart. I've already found a whole bunch of ruins down here. Yep. Mm. I saw your little trick there. You used your right hand to get that construct going. I'll grab that power you cheated me out of for myself. Off at the western, southwestern abandoned mine. Then the magnificent one and I will guide this world to this miserable end. And there's nothing you can do to stop us. Okay. So don't follow me. <laughs> right, bye bye. I guess. So he's at the southwestern mine. Got it. I excuse me. Thank you for repelling the trespassers. I hope you will pardon me for listening in on your conversation. That man mentioned an abandoned mine to the southwest. I suspect that he is referring to the former Gerudo mine. That place flourished with activity long ago like this one, or was constantly unearthed and refined. There are statues that point the way in a, to the abandoned Guru mine. Follow them and reach that destination. I recommend you begin by making your way to the light you see over there. One more thing before you set out on your journey. If there is something I would like you to have, please speak of my associate when possible. Okay, I'll speak to him. Hello, Bubun. God, I love them. I love these guys. Thank you for driving out the trespassers. I will no longer need a hide in order to avoid detection. There is another reason that it is good you have come. I see that you have the ability to auto build. That means the scheme. Schema stone? Schema stone? I carry is for you. These stone slabs depict schematics of things such as zonide vehicles. Auto build saves its schematic and builds it on command. I bet. Oh, I can get two now. Oh, okay. It's just, no, it's just a fan play. Okay, bet. New design has been registered with the auto build. You should now be able to auto build an additional design. Please wait while I, re while I prepare the necessary parts for you to test the schema stone. Schema stone. Schematic? Schema? Schema stone? It's such a weird word. <laughs> okay. Skimma stones can help you build to build things that you've never before imagined. I hope that you find this one useful. Okay, bet. Uh, yeah, auto build. Let's do the fan plane. Hell yeah. Let's uh, let's just use you then, since we gotta go over to the light. I still only have one battery for this, but we're gonna do it. Ooh. Okay. That that's cute. Oh <laughs> We gonna get this light root. And then we gonna go back to the surface. So that was cool. Little temples, cute as fuck. There's two statues up here. What is that? There's a little hut. I guess I follow these statues then. Oh hello. They are strange statues. Mm. These stone statues have suspicious written all over them. Oh, you ever heard me, did you? Ah. Take a look at this giant stone statue. Now, like, it's dark and hard to see, but look, there's one over there, too. It seems that each statue points in directions form long statue chain. Not going to live long enough to see any more of it, are you, Link? God fucking damn it. I fucking hate Yiga Clan, dude. God damn it. I just wanted to see what the hut was. <laughs> My curiosity has gotten the best of me, and I want to see the hut. Oh, and there's something in the fucking sky? What's that? Yiga thing. Got it. Maybe it's a Yiga hut. Maybe I don't want to go there. You know, maybe that's the Yiga hideout. Maybe I don't want to go there. Maybe maybe I've taken it back. Maybe I don't want to do that yet. A Yiga hut. Yeah, okay, okay, cool. I'm just gonna... Just gonna not do that. Oh my god, I'm way over here. Oh, I guess I also gotta talk to Joshua. Joshua! Swordsman, what is it? You look very pleased with yourself. Could it be? A U T O build? Oh, with the ability to instantly replicate things you build? And schema stones? Oh. So there really was a Zonai temple housing a mysterious power down in the depths. Mm -hmm. That may also mean that there are some things collected from the depths may give us other clues. Wait here just a sec. Not that. No, not that either. Aha! Here we go. Here, swordsman. 
I get another one? Ah, oh, I can make a hot air balloon. Just, and now I can do it. I can do it outside because they have the hot air balloon stuff outside. Cool. This is Schema Stone for a balloon, right? If you used it with the auto build, you could replicate a balloon, right? I'm thinking, go balloon over there that belongs to Goggles. It's broken right now. Do you think you might be able to fix it with auto build? Yeah, I'm so excited. I want to see it in action pronto. I'll go prepare quickly. All right, bet. I'll auto build a balloon. <laughs> Swordsman, everything's ready. <laughs> Please demonstrate how auto build replicates things. We're going to the balloon. So Zonite is what I use to auto build things. Got it. I, I can't believe it. You rebuilt the balloon in an instant. This this mysterious power goes beyond scientific explanation. Goggles. Hey. Goggles. <laughs> he just fucking turns out like, yes. <laughs> what are you yelling about, Jasha? <laughs> Inconceivable. <laughs> My balloon, it's fixed. This must be the mysterious power that Zonai had. I never thought I'd see such a marvel in my very own eyes. Thank you for making this a reality. Please, take this. I've been saving it for a special occasion. I still haven't been able to figure out what it is. But judging from that light, it's gotta be Zonai in origin. Since you can use Zonai powers, I think it'll, better, it'll be better for you to have it. Yeah. There are incredible power lying hidden in the depths after all. I think I'll keep researching the depths and going forward. Who knows? I might just find a clue for Princess Zelda. If you make any new discoveries in the depths, please let me know, Swordsman. Aye, aye, Captain. Um, yes? Did you need something, Swordsman? I want something to return. Oh, okay, Koga. <laughs> no way. Koga, the leader of the Yiga clan, was there? Oh, this is dangerous. Okay. I've got to my regain my composure. Okay, come this way. We're going to do something about Koga? So you faced Koga in the depths. Hmm. What's the leader of the Yiga clan up to down there? From what I know, the Yiga clan is a super dangerous group that's schemes against the kingdom of Hyrule, and Koga has it, has headed out for you and Princess Zelda for a long time. He'd do anything to put an end to your lives. Despite everything we're looking into already, we can't just take our eyes off this threat. Besides, Koga could know what's happened to the princess. That would make a lot of sense. If you do go after him, keep in mind that I'll be continuing my research of the depths from here. Uh -huh. Oh, by the way, do you know about the Forest of Time south of Hyrule Field? There's a chasm there, and I've gotten reports of another series of statues found at the bottom of it. These statues are different from the one you showed me using the camera. They seem to point the way there. Okay, they, they seem to point the way somewhere. There you go, too. And do come near where you got your auto, abil auto build ability. But they don't stop there. These statues lead farther southwest into the depths. Yeah, okay, the southwest abandoned mine. Yeah. And far beyond that building oh. we're seeing. I'll keep gathering into the info about what's in the depths, so be sure to stop by and check without... Check out with me sometimes. Okay, so like it's the in the forest that's south of Hyrule. Okay, I also got two dragon tears so far, so like I'm actually doing pretty okay. I can get rid of this stamp. <laughs> I don't. I don't need this stamp anymore. Still got a lot of pins everywhere. What was this pin? What was that pin? Hold on. Is that pin just Kakariko Village? Please don't tell me it is. No, it's not. It's facing differently. What are you pinning? What did I pin over there? I guess I pinned something. All right. Oh, yeah, the lab. He wants to get to the lab in Hateno, right? Appreciate you fixing up my balloon ultra. Thanks. The autobill thing is pretty darn amazing. I should good. I should have a good think about all the practical uses of that someday. Oh, well, that reminds me. Hey, you. Listen up. Now that Josh has solved the mystery of that slate, I can return to the Pure Pad Laboratory in Hateno Village. Yeah. I gotta see. I have to see my house. I've got to see my house. If you go there, I can make even more improvements to your Pure Pad, starting with the sensor. Lab in the east and nuke. In Nek Luda, off the southeast corner of Hyrule, it's on the far side of... Yeah, I know, I remember where it is. See a mighty peculiar place. Don't let the looks of you fool it. It's a edge lab. Got you. See you there. He just fucking dipped. <laughs> cool. Uh, I prefer to keep work and my personal time separate. So you bother me some more time? Not your guy. Scorpus? Scorpus is your guy. Okay. She has the Rito armor here? Is it because I bought the Rito armor? Is that is that why you have it? Why do you have it? Interesting. I'm gonna buy shit to it. Ah, I don't fucking money i don't want money all right well we gotta go to what we gotta do what's all things we gotta do yeah master koga engraved with the ancient hyrulean oh that's right yeah so he's in kakariko village i have to go to hateno which is past kakariko village i have to go to woodland stable though with that one and that one is the shrine quest oh i gotta report back to them it's can't be stable without you and carson Let's get to business. Seeing that you're already a stable member, I'd like to give you one point for visiting your first. Oh, fuck yeah. Right off this mini stable alone, so I can go after you a stable. Oh, what well, stable could. We'll bring out horses here. I think I just had to return back to them. Because I already got the guy here. Let me just let me just report back to them. 
Not super easy, but like, I'll do it. I did miss some shrines here, so like, maybe we'll gather some shrines, report back to them about this shit, and then continue on towards Kakariko. Because more shrines is always good. Yeah, I know, I should be able to have that done. God, I love the music, Arendo. I, I listen to like, um, really long, like five hour, six hour videos on YouTube. That's just like Breath of the Wild and Tears of Kingdom music for calm, like, steady shit. And I love the Rito theme. It's amazing. I'm sorry, Carson. I wish we had more building supplies for you to use. I'm just saying this, this is my fault, not yours. I was too rosy with my estimates. Rosy? Rousy? Ro- Ah, uh, Link, it's about the bridge job. We fit a bit of a snag. You see, the thing's in worse shape than I accounted for. Carson here has made some short 20 pieces of wood. Fantastic. Let me just go uh... cut down all of the trees. And I will get you your wood, hmm. sire. Don't proper? Yeah. <laughs> How I did the, um, like, Terrytown quest in Breath of the Wild was with the bombs. And I hate that you don't have bombs this time. It sucks. I like the bombs. I haven't done much. I, like, ran right to Rito Village to do Poulin's quest. And I was like, I haven't done any side quests. <laughs> Bell, you should see me doing fucking Terrytown. I was just sitting there, Logan was sitting next to me. I was just blowing up forests constantly. <laughs> like, this is the fastest way to do it. Here, I got your wood. Retrospect this bridge we're talking about, so I guess it makes sense. Here you go. Wood. 20 pieces of it. That was a real pain in my neck. It took all of like two minutes to collect Carson. You could have you could have done it too. <laughs> I swear. Ah. Dig it. With all the materials. Time to fix this busted bridge of yours. Sun and done. Walk this down a little far to the left. Not that far. <laughs> it's falling down the cliff timber. <laughs> sure come in handy or wingy. Let's see your tail down there. Support beam not bridge. Now for the finishing touch. Here goes. Fucking um, quality blink and we're done. <laughs> What's every son chooses? Hudson's construction. Feeling pumped? Gotta get this done in one fell swoop. God, he talks a lot when he builds a bridge. Sun and done. Hell yeah. Bridge. Amazing. Fantastic. Now I can carry supplies across. A little weird about how it turned out, but what a beaut. I could hit this bridge with 10 blizzards at once and it wouldn't. That's so much as creak. With that done, life in Rito Village returned to something like normal. I'll take responsibility for guarding the bridge. Please accept this gift. Add the money set aside for repairing the bridge, but I hope you'll get some use out of it. Ah. Yeah, don't pay Carson, the one that built it, but pay me. <laughs> I'm off to lookout landing. If you need my help, just say the word and I'll come running. No problems, ah. too small. Ah, same goes for you. If you have an open invitation to call upon our help. Hell yeah. Bridge connecting Highlands and Rito, literally and otherwise. <laughs> Hell yeah, great article, Tracy. It's fixed. Look how nice it is. Because this shit had like holes in it. In fucking Breath of the Wild, it's so nice. All right, now I'm gonna go up to that shrine. Cause it's just staring at me. Oh, that's where we got up into Tulin shit. Yeah, cause there's a ship. All right, cool. I was like, this looks familiar. I feel like I should know it now. This shit is what I saw when I first did started the game, and that shit looks sick. Really, guys, more spikes. Really, you don't need all the spikes, you know. This is a little fucking overkill, guys. Guys, <laughs> seriously, this is a little overkill. <laughs> what the fuck? I don't have to burn the spikes down. I can just jump off the diving platform up here. It's just, it's just, just a diving platform. Shrine, 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 shrine. A launching device. This is just a rocket, guys. <laughs> this is just a rocket. Oh my god. Face the right way, please. Have fun. Rockets. <laughs> Minecarts. We love that. So I had to take the rocket and put it on the back. Take the rocket from the back of the minecart. <laughs> just steal the arm minecart though. And like, that minecart is becoming mine. Hey, right, let's go. <laughs> Holy fuck. Do I do I just launch with the minecart? That's what I do. It's like I'll do it. <laughs> oh my god. It's gonna suck. All the way up the stairs. Holy. I hello, Raru. <laughs> oh my god. Free crystal. Not crystal. Light. Free light. Because you know that's that's quantifiable. <laughs> Maybe we do some exploring. Oh, there's an shrine over there. Marked. Fantastic. Look at me go. Don't know what that is. I did that shrine. <laughs> I think. I did that shrine. Yeah, I did that. I did that shrine. Bridge over there, there's a pin over there, so it might be in our shrine. That bridge of oh, the stable. That went all the way over there. Is that geoglyph? It is. Did I do that geoglyph? I did not. You know what? Maybe we do that. Oh, Addison. Wait, Addison, no, I know how to help you now.
Hell yeah, I can stay here forever. I got you, I got you, I got you. I will help you out, my friend. Here you go. Now let go? Maybe that'll keep it? Ah, god damn it. Really? Snug this right up to it. I'm gonna say that works. Stop being scared. Talk to me. There you go. Ah. Oh. Be behind or gonna fall? Nah, nah. Oh. See? There you go. Easy. Mm. With your help, President Hudson is now Stanley standing firmly in place. Hell yeah, rupee. <laughs> I am hungry. Fantastic. We love spicy ah. veggie rolls. Oh, another something? Bomb flower. Hell yeah. Oh. Well, guys. Oh, there he is. <gasps> Smell a story. Mm. Hmm. Hardly a trace of a recipe remains. That just. Just the remnants of half-eaten Hylian pine cones. Hey, partner. You're looking good. Were you also pulled up to this place by an inescapable tug of a story? I'm chasing some new chirps and warbles from my beloved little birds. A group of goats is a herd or a trip or a tribe. Anyway, this stable has been raising a small herd of white goats. Or it was until all those white goats end up and vanished all of a sudden. Mm. That's not where it stops, though. Some have said that Princess Zelda may also be involved. Anyway, why don't you talk to Twerk, the guy who takes care, who was taking care of the white goats. I'll look for more oh. clues. Partner, this time for you to get to work. There's a big scoop here. I can feel it. Hi, Twerk. Hey, buddy. Have you seen some white goats around here? I've given those goats all the love and care in the world, but the other day they ran off together. They didn't even finish all their food before they left. The Hylian pine cones weren't eaten. I followed Princess Zelda's recipe perfectly, but could have, <laughs> couldn't have been the feed that drove them off. Oh. Recipe. Princess Zelda shared a recipe when she visited the stable a while back. It's really amazing how much she knows about, about animals. I never would have expected her to be developing healthy feed recipes. In this case, it's a recipe for a special kind of feed for white goats. The main ingredient is fresh Hylian pine cones. <laughs> it's actually pretty unusual. It requires you to mix the pine cones in whole. You don't grind them down or anything. I didn't want my wonderful white goats to eat the recipe the princess gave me, so I put it in a glass bottle. But a big storm came through one day and blew the bottle off somewhere was able to find after that so i've been making the recipe from memory since then mm. but who would make my white goat spit up the hylian pine cones and run off like that did they they really hate princess elder's recipe that much i don't think it was her recipe i don't think it was her you know right, so that blew off the bottle somewhere i'm so scared thinking everything's a fucking talus now i hate the taluses though they're scary okay so i didn't want to do archery training but like i guess i'm here now the music of the shrines or something. Say your aim and fire the enemy's head. The other attacks aren't effective. Yep. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Shoots in head. Only shoots in head. Only thing that I can do shoots in head. Arrows. Well done. <laughs> what? Don't fear the approaching enemies. Fire true, strike their heads. I don't want to fight three of them. What the fuck? Just gotta shoot these guys' heads? Oh my god. I'm feeling everything. There you go. Okay. There you go. Fucking gun. Start choking hard. I hate the fucking combat training ones though. But like, I'm glad I haven't come past the fucking test of strength ones. Those shit suck. I also will say, I do love that Tears of the Kingdom lets me drop shit in the chest. I appreciate that so much, so it's not like Breath of the Wild where I have to fucking go out of the chest, drop it, go back into the chest. I like the sheep gonna be like way over there or some shit. Oh, do I have that marked? I do have that marked. Look at me. Me thinking ahead. Major quality of life improvement. Facts. Okay, so I did that glyph. There's a glyph. Where did the glyph go? There's the glyph. Alright, so I gotta go over there. It was like... Did it roll off into the canyon? Is that where it dropped? I'll give it one look since I did do the shrine. Oh, wait, it's in the well, isn't it? It's in the well. Is it gonna be that easy where it's gonna be in the well? <laughs> oh, hello. Did not expect to see you. Oh, froggy. Give me froggy. Thank you. Ever think about this game this far? Um, Raru. <laughs> <laughs> That was my favorite thing about this game so far. The spirits, so the spirit of the sages, like I have Tulin right now, right? That's sick. So I can use his fucking thing. Yeah, like I, I, I do like the sages. The sages are sick. We love them. The temple for at least Tulin was really fucking hard at first. <laughs> the fucking ice thing that came out where you had to shoot him. I hate it. Water quality, fair. Moss growth, extensive. Bright caps, present. All right, that's everything all jotted down. Huh? 
what are you doing in like place like this? Although I'm in a place like this. Hey, you wouldn't happen to be a well enthusiast, would you? Of course. <laughs> I thought so. My name's Farah. I have a deep love of wells, too. <laughs> wells are endlessly fascinating. Their damp environment, their unique systems of life, how they stay cool when it's hot outside. Well, enthusiasts, get it. <laughs> Just get it. The appeal of a good well, that is. Hell yeah. My dream is to travel around every single well throughout Hy Hyrule. After scouring all the ancient oh. texts, fuck, I, sadly I haven't been able to identify their exact locations. I may but if you have any interest in wells, then maybe you could help me. Would you know? Would you tell me of any well locations you know oh. of? I'll reward you, of course. Ten rupees per location. Why have one? Right? I, I think I have one. I think I've been in one well. Five of them. I've been in five of them. Never mind. <laughs> Ten rupees. Ah, fuck yeah. 50, 50 rupees. There's a total of 53 to find. Also over the place. Towns and stables, of course. Even more wells that used in the past, distant past exist within ruins. You on lookout landing? Got you. Got you. I'll meet you there. Got like 69 rupees. Still thanks to diamonds. I live for 200 plus bomb flowers. 500k rupees. What the fuck, guys? <laughs> I'm just sitting here like, yeah. 100 so rupees. <laughs> this is my life. Do I have a stick? I do have a stick. I just... I wanted the big boulder. I'll take it. What the fuck? Oh no, lizard. So that's bubbly. I don't like that it's bubbly. Yeah, you just sink. All right, cool. Um, I put you like here though, so I can get a little farther in. I know I don't have to see where it goes, but like I want to see where it goes. Oh, there's the other one. I've made a bridge. Perfect. Hudson would be proud of me. It's still gonna be the same Goron that was here in Breath of the Wild. Ultra Ball Hall check-in. So I did golf last time here. What what's going on now? Hey there, kid. Hard not to sleep in on a nice morning like this. Must mean you got hankering for Ultra Ball Hall, am I right? What the fuck is that? <laughs> what's that from the blank stare? Super popular habit forming Ultra Ball Hall. It's so hard. It's the only one that ever played it, so I've hit all of my lonesome. Carry the ball as far as you can before time runs out. Play on a cart, lug in your arms, whatever works. Lose the ball and you lose the game. The farther you take it, the better your rewards. Make sure you hustle. Sure. Got it. I don't have a steering thing. Oh, steering thing. I right, bet. Like the best damn cart you've ever seen. This might not be good, but we're going to give it a try. Did not start. God damn it. <laughs> did, not, did not start. It's going to break my, my building. It did. God damn it. I didn't know I had to talk to him first. I thought I was just going to start. Anyway, <laughs> I will be doing this. I will at least try to get as far as I can, but we're going to do a different way. We're going to take the cart boy. The, the tiny, the tiny cart boy. Now we got to talk to him. It's never been carried before. Go. Go as fox in the way. No, Fox. Oh, I just keep rolling? Oh, I'll just keep rolling. Let's just see how far it gets. We, go we going? We're slowly going. At 192.7. You took that ball a grand total of 192.7 meters away. There you go. That's pretty good, kid. But you can even do better than that next time. That's it. All right, cool. <laughs> He literally mentioned, he was like, oh, there's pine cones. So what we gotta do is we gotta follow the trail of pine cones. So there was a pine cone in the pen. Okay, here's a pine cone. All oh, the pine cones find the sheep goats. Yeah, I totally did not realize this. I'm gonna shit ton of fucking pine cones after this. Is that one? I think that's one. Goat boy. Oh, was that another one? There it was. Oh, and the bottle. Oh, those are my white goats. So this is where they ran off to. There, there. I'm just so glad to see you. Are you all okay? And you're the one who found them. Thank you. I won't forget this. This bottle. This is what I was using to keep Princess Zelda's recipe safe. Let me see. I need to check the recipe. Mm. Yes. Yes. Oh. Wait. Oh no. Grind the pine cone to powder. I'm not supposed to use Hylian pine cone whole. I should have known something was off. It really did look hard to eat. My poor sweet goats. They must have run off because the awful food I was making them eat. I'm so sorry. I hurt all of you when I thought I was helping. It was my fault all along. I would have run away too. I can't believe I doubted the recipe that Princess Zelda shared with me. I should have noticed my mistake right away. After all, I really do want to take the best possible care of these goats. What's not 
talking about what kind of food you feed them, right? It's important to show them you care with all your heart. I swear that from now on, I will take care of you all with the same kindness and compassion that Princess Zelda displays. It's the best way to show my gratitude for sharing her recipe with me. Oh, and I really, really can't thank you enough for finding my white goats and the recipe. We're going to be heading back to the stable. You take care. Hello, Pen. Oh. I saw everything, partner. Ah. A perfect investigation with a happy ending. I'd expect nothing less from you. Mm, do you think it's a coincidence that the missing white goats and the lost recipe were in the same place? I have another theory. Maybe the white goats set out to find the bottle themselves because they couldn't stand to eat the wrong recipe anymore. I don't think that's the case, but it, don't, it doesn't make you wonder, doesn't it? It do, it do make you think. Oh, that's right. This was your first job, wasn't it? Partner, you did quite well to get such results your first time out. Why, I'm feeling a little proud of myself. Here's the star of the old nest egg. Fuck yeah. As you take on more stories, your base pay will obviously increase. And there are bonuses, of course. Keep up the good work. Alright, I'm gonna hurry back to HQ. We'll bring the word to story's conclusion to our readers. See you later, partner. Bye-bye, partner. I'm gonna go to the geoglyph next. And then we can go to Kekriko. If there's not a shrine next to the geoglyph. <laughs>